Hello, sir. Yeah, Henry, how far? Sorry, master. I beg, when I don't open. Yeah. When I don't open. Eh. Uh, in around. Eh, yeah, I know, yeah. You got no problem, I reckon. Okay. All right. I'm going to show you guys how you can make and receive calls from the SIM card in your phone directly from your laptop or your desktop. Now, bear in mind that with this method I'm going to show you in this video, you can actually change your voice from a male voice to a female voice, or a female voice to a male voice. And you're calling directly from your SIM card, the SIM card, any SIM card that is in your phone. Now, let's dive right into my system. Let me show you guys how that is done. Come to your system and come to setting, type setting, and um, enter. I am using Windows 11. This actually works mostly on Windows 11, but you can try it in Windows 10 or Windows 8. But I'm using Windows 11 to do this. Go to Bluetooth and um, device. Scroll down here and come to phone link. When you get to phone link, click on open phone link and wait for it to come up. Okay, it's right here. Now, as you can see, use your phone from your PC. Make and take calls. Keep up with your conversation. View your phone notification on your PC. Pick your phone. Android is available for now. iPhone, as you guys can see here, iPhone will be coming very soon. So I'm going to use my Android to do this. Click on Android. Now, once you get to this page, click on I have the link to Windows app ready. But before you do that, let's come to my Android. Get to your Android and go to your Google Play Store and search for link to Windows. All right, so I've already downloaded this, okay, as you can see, open, but if you've not downloaded it, make sure you click on install. And once you install it, it will now show you open. Now we're going to open this, open this app, your phone and PC are linked, okay? Let me sign out so that we can start afresh. Now open this app. Okay, link your phone and PC. Click on link. You can see here is the QR code on your PC ready. Now come to your PC and click on I have the link to window app ready. Click on it and then pay with QR code. Once you click on pay with QR code, it's going to come up with a new QR code. And on your phone, you're going to click on continue. Now, please bear in mind that if you're doing this, you have to make sure that you're logged into your Microsoft account. Okay, because if you're not logged into your Microsoft account, this is not going to work. I mean, on your Windows 11 laptop. Now, this barcode is out. Click on continue on your phone. Allow. Okay, come here, scan this barcode. Pairing with PC. Okay. Continue. Allow. Done. Here I click on continue. Welcome to the phone link app. Open phone link when I sign in to Windows. Get started. View my photo, send this message, make a call. Okay? So, leave your phone in your pocket, make and take call from your PC, give it a try. Now, get started. Over here, you can see if you come to text message, there's nothing here yet. So, what you have to do is make sure that the Bluetooth on your laptop and on your phone is activated. Okay, and go to your setting. Okay, the Bluetooth is on. Come here. Finish up your notification. Okay, open setting on your phone. Let's wait. Okay. On your phone, I think you have to 
allow this link to windows allow let's get your device connected let's get your device connected again check that your phone and pc are connected to the internet and restart the app my pc and my phone they are connected on this on the internet but not on the same internet so what i have to do is i have to hotspot my laptop let them be on the same internet note 8 continue okay it's asking me to put the password of my phone they are now connected okay click on sync over mobile so you guys should make sure you come to setting and click on sync over mobile this is actually what is making it not to show if you off this it's not going to come up so you have to open sync over mobile data okay so that you can use mobile data even without your wi-fi here you can see all the messages in your phone and um, if you come to photo it's going to bring out photos you can see different images now let's go to call which is why we are making this video once you get to call click on get started get called set up allow allow access to contact and call history click on it pair yes good we need permission to display your recent calls on your phone send permission allow on the phone now you can see all the calls that um, all the numbers have been calling for some days so i am going to bring my iphone and then dial this number let's see what is going to happen oh i just got a notification somebody just paid in 60k into my account all right so if i go to message now i will see this but let's focus on the call and um i have another phone here samsung and i'm going to use it to make a call i just hope there's credit in this phone star 123 hash as an etl okay zero eight one six so i'm going to call my number now let's see if it's going to pop up i'm calling the number now okay he's saying i do not have sufficient air time to complete the call while they're starting error in this um um number so let me call back i'm trying to call back now let's see if this phone is going to ring click here and click on call you guys can see i'm calling this number you can see now i'm calling this number you can see if i cut it here let me shift this if i cut it here you can see i have cut the call now the fact that you can make call through your laptop by connecting your phone which you are actually dialing through your sim to the other end you can now decide to change your microphone to um, voice mood which is um voice changer for pc change it on the root section the way i showed you guys um in the previous video i made on how to change your voice on live call voice mode can change application voice 
Once you change it in the root section of your laptop, it's going to change everything that is coming through this mic. Every single call, whether it's direct call, whether it's an app call, any kind of call that you're actually making through this PC. Once you set it to um, voice mode, I'm going to make another video and show you one of the best um, voice changer app that you can use on your PC. And um, that voice changer will still work like voice mode, but that one is quite better. So with this method, you can connect the voice mode and um, the other voice changer I'm going to show you in my next video and in my next two, three videos to your laptop. When you make direct call with your SIM card, the SIM card that is in your phone, okay, in your Android phone, Apple, they will be launching the Apple app very soon. It's coming very soon. When you connect your phone to your laptop and use it to make call, you can actually change your voice from male voice to a female voice or a female voice to male voice. I will detail about that in that video, but it's quite very easy. I also detailed it in my previous video, which I'm going to put at the end of this video in case you've not watched that on how to change your male voice to a female voice or a female voice to a male voice or cartoon voice um, on your PC while making call with application that is on your PC. So with this, you can make call directly with your SIM card via your laptop or your desktop. But please, if you're making call on your laptop, if you're using your your laptop's uh, mic, the internal mic in your laptop, most times it echoes. If you want to avoid that, you have to get a headphone. With headphone, once you connect a headphone that has a mic, your voice won't echo anymore because with good headphone with mic, it will keep your voice very clear and it won't be echoing but if you're making call and using the mic on your laptop or desktop most times it echoes so if you want to use this make sure you get a headphone you can call directly you can receive call you can check messages you can get notification about any app in your phone so that is it so if you have any question make sure you drop your question or if there's anything confusing in this video drop it in the comment section below this video it's quite very simple for you to do this connection and if you're watching my video for the first time my name is Asuke Nakinsley and on this channel I give you tips and solutions on how to make money online and other relevant tips that helps in our daily online space but during the weekend I make sure I give you updates on new games and apps in the virtual reality space so if you wouldn't want to miss any of my content please make sure you're subscribed to this channel and make sure the notification button is turned on so that you'll be the first to know once I upload a new video I will see you guys in my next video you guys should stay creative and remain blessed.